Hi there, I'm Ethan Foreheads. First on this Tuesday night, the Texas County Sheriff and his chief deputy went before a judge today on the other side of the law. They were both indicted last week by a grand jury on six felonies and two misdemeanors. And court records indicate they were in a, a romantic relationship. Sarah Forehats was in the courtroom today, has the latest tonight. Yeah, Ethan, many in this county say it has really become a matter of public safety. Some 40 employees have left the Texas County Sheriff's Department under Sheriff James Sigmund and his chief deputy, Jennifer Tomaszewski. But now that they are out, many of those employees say they are hoping to come back. You understand that? The list against them both is long. Four charges you with the class E felony of unlawful use of a weapon. And now, former sheriff James Sigmund and former chief deputy Jennifer Tomaszowski stood silent before Judge Gaston, both pleading not guilty to felony assault, endangerment of a child, in that Sigmund allowed Tomaszowski to bring a child to the jail to work with her, misuse of a weapon, impersonation, in that she operated as an officer before finishing academy and misuse of official information by a public servant. Hope to have it over with quick, whatever the outcome may be, but uh, the sooner the better for the town, I think, and for the county. Locals say they're hopeful for a strong leader to come in and take over. Court records say Sigmund didn't intervene when Tomaszowski threatened one inmate and beat another. She also carried a gun and at one point even pointed it at bystanders, even a child, because they were filming, which she mistakenly thought they couldn't do. A new sheriff has been named to be in position until the November election. I need, need somebody at the helm that's got some experience and I think Rowdy does. And if convicted, both of them could spend the rest of their lives in prison on those slew of charges. Again, the special prosecutor says he's hoping to speed this thing along for the safety of the county. Reporting from Houston, I'm Sarah Foreheads.